And now, Bella, on a vector field is to ask, is there a source for the field or a sink that the field terminates into? And that's equivalent to asking, looking over the surface, whether you've got a net flux that's non-zero or not. So we've got our surface integral of the vector quantity. So we're saying that this, this particular quantity here was equal to the current flowing out of the surface. But that must be equal to the rate at which charge is lost from within the volume. So we've got a minus sign, which is the, the loss from within. And so, so it's a time rate of change. It deals with what happens over or within the volume of the quantity. So it's going to volume integral, so our element of integration is a volume element. In this case, it's going to be charge, the charge density. Remember, this is charge per 